Hi, my name is Ken Clinton. I'm with my partner, Mark Beaver. We're with Intrepid Power Boats. We're here at our Dania Beach sales office at Harbor Time Marina, and we're here to introduce you to our newest model, the 327 Cuddy. Yeah, really excited about this new model. We've taken all of the things that you as the customer have talked to us about in design changes. We've changed the cabin, the cockpit layout, the console, and our new hull design. So let's go take a look. Now, as for the new hull design of the 327 Cuddy, it's quite different from the 323 Cuddy. We've actually extended the running surface, we've widened the chine beam, and we've actually incorporated a lot of other innovative features that help it accommodate the new heavier four strokes. Now moving back towards the transom, you can see we've incorporated our new rolled tumble home design into the new 327 Cuddy. What's really nice is when we talk to our customers, they give us lots of feedback. Because we work with them directly on every build, when we design a new boat, we're able to take their comments and implement them right into the design. One of the things that we heard quite a bit was that the forward cuddy area was, in essence, a large closet. So we decided if this is going to be a place where you put a lot of your items forward, that we're going to organize your closet. And we did this by using space that wasn't being used before. One of the things that we did is we incorporated overhead storage. If you remember on the old model, that we used to have valances that ran across here. Now we've integrated overhead storage that runs uh, fore and aft on both sides. Gives you plenty of storage in an area that you never even used before. Another comment that we used to have was the head being inside the cuddy. It was really nice because it had the rotating design, but in the same token, if there was somebody down inside the cabin, you had to kick them out in order to use the head. So we removed it from inside the cuddy and it opened up a couple different items for us. One, it gave us a nice storage area where it used to be because you can never get enough dry storage. And also by moving the head out of the cuddy cabin and putting it in the console, which you'll see here shortly, it also allowed us to move the sink out of here. By moving the sink out, it gave us some surface area and it also gave us a place to put our refrigerator. Another feature that was an option on the last Cuddy version is now standard on this one. The filler pieces that are down below are incorporated right into the design. So now, anytime you want to make a complete cabin forward, you can just flip them up, the cushion store inside the closet, and there's a support right underneath that's built into the floor. One of the other things that's very important is making sure that there's enough room in the new head inside the console. Because Mark and I are over six foot tall, we make sure that we design all of these to fit even guys our size. Another comment that we got from our customers was our forward seating area. Though there was plenty of forward seating, it could have been a lot more comfortable. So what we did to accomplish that is we angled the backrest and we made the bases a lot wider. So now when you sit on it, it's not just using a bolster area as your backrest. We built you a backrest to sit against. Another comment was the storage areas underneath the forward seating. Everybody said there was plenty of storage, but it could have been easier to get to. So what we did is we made the hatches a little bit bigger, a little bit wider, so now you can get even larger items in and out easily. Another nice thing we did with the new 327 Cuddy is we developed a new console which not only incorporates the head inside of it, it actually has the new bullet style sidelines and incorporates the new electronic battery switch system. You can turn everything off with one switch. Now moving around to the helmsman position of our new console, you'll see that we've incorporated two storage trays on top for your wallet, cell phone, sunglasses. Large flat area for all the newest electronics, large area over here for any electronics. We've incorporated two of the cup holders and a nice glove box. Now moving over to the new switch panel, we've incorporated stainless steel IP65 rated switches, which means that they are submersible to 15 feet. When you turn them on, they have a small LED light that lights up blue. Now moving over to the port side of the console, we've incorporated a large insulated 30 quart cooler. Now just after the cooler, we've incorporated a rear facing seat, which we did in the 40 Cuddy, which was a huge hit with everybody. It's a very comfortable, nice conversation area with the helmsman. What's also nice about this rear facing seat is it has a large storage bin underneath of it. 
This particular 327 Cuddy was outfitted with our pedestal helm seat, which not only goes back and forth, but it also goes up and down to adjust infinite positions for the helmsman. This particular 327 Cuddy is outfitted with our newly designed swing-in side dive door. It actually swings all the way back and flat against the gunnel. Another new option that we've developed that we've installed in this particular 327 Cuddy is our new hydraulic deployed dive ladder. Then moving back to the aft cockpit, we've got an extra large insulated and macerated fish box. Extra large access to the aft lazarette where the bilge pumps are located. Live bait well. And over here by the dive door, there's an extra large storage area. Located in the aft starboard corner is yet another storage bin that could also be rigged as a live well. Next to it, over in the center, is another hatch that gives you access to our optional freshwater flushing system. You merely hook up a hose to one fitting, turn the valve to flush the engines. No more climbing over the back of the boat to access the flush fittings on the engines themselves. We want to thank everybody for taking a minute out of their day to allow Mark and I to give you a review of the new 327 Cuddy. You know, we're the ones that bring it to fruition, but you guys are the real designers. All our customers out there, they give us the feedback. That's how we make a better boat the second time around. The only thing left for you to do is to come visit our sales office at Harbortown Marine in Dania Beach, and let's go for a ride.